Hey everybody, so it's me Manda here. So um, I wanted to do this on camera and I had told Victoria that I would, but the video literally was just 10 minutes of me and my sister going, shut up, this smells so good. So I decided to refilm it. So anyways, um, I did place a Candles by Victoria order and this is what I got. Um, so hopefully I don't go over time. So the first thing I got was a tart warmer and this is what it looks like. I got the yellow one. Um, it's plugged in over here burning a tart, so that's why I'm not going to show it to you. Um, so I'll do like a little story real quick because I do want to say thank you to Victoria. She was nice enough to help me out with something. Um, I originally had placed two orders. I had ordered my candles and my scent shots, and then I went back and ordered a tart warmer because that same day, I kid you not, I broke the dish to my one that I had. So I was like, well, I need a new one, so I went and I ordered one. So I ended up having to pay shipping twice, which I was glad to do. You know, I figured, you know, hey, I had to do it. But then I was on her message board, but I'm on her message board, so shout out to everyone on the board. Hi. And um, someone else had asked her, had been in a similar situation. She had ordered two orders in one day and had asked instead of having to pay shipping twice because she just included some scent shots. And I was like, well, you know, it, it wouldn't hurt to ask. All she can do is say no. So I asked her, and she was nice enough to include a surprise bag of uh, heart tarts. Um, for my second shipping uh, payment that I had to make, I guess, which I'm really excited about. I have one of them in the tart warmer now because I figure I'm going to use these first. Um, and it is smelling of this room like insanely bad. And these are seriously like, look how small they are. They're like this small compared to a scent shot, which compared to a scent shot. And these are smelling of this room like really crazy. But anyway. So we're already trying to figure out what some of these are, but um, thank you, Victoria, very much for that. I appreciate it a lot. So I guess I'll start with the scent shots since they're right here next to me. The first one I got is Bella Swan, which is this really pretty purple. And it's, it's supposed to be like a floral, and I, I do get the floral, but to me this one kind of it's more candy-ish. But it does smell like really divine and I am probably going to be ordering a mini jar in this. And then the next one that I got, this one is Jacob Black. And this one, like, I was a little bit worried when I um, saw people's reviews on it because a lot of people were saying it smelled like Dracar Noir um, Men's Cologne, which I actually do have and it's a long story of why I have it, but I have it. And it does kind of have that same smell. It's a very manly smell. It kind of, I smell like, like the woods, and I really, really do like it. So I probably will order a candle in this as well. Then the third one, of course, I had to get the Patriarch Edward Cullen. This one is really floral, and it's like, I don't want to smell like sunshine, and um, I'm really bad with scent descriptions. But it smells really good. So, so far the Twilight ones are like amazing. This next one I got for Erin because um, if you've ever been to Victoria's site, she has like some 200 to some, some 500 scents. And Erin and my mother really like cinnamony scents, but I was worried because that her scents are so... Um, strong but the cinnamon one might be a little bit too strong um, so I got this one and it's um, cinnamon buns and this one no joke guys it smells like you know like when you open the cinnamon bun can and like you have like that raw dough and the cinnamon it, it's dead on it smells really good so then um, I got one red velvet cake and I got this one um, because of Michelle 1218 and I love red velvet cake too and this is straight up cake batter and I may do a, um, I may do a create a scent and mix red velvet cake with cream cheese frosting and get and name it like red velvet cake with frosting because I think if you add the frosting to this it would be really good so Victoria Comfort candle idea, red velvet cake and cream cheese frosting. <laughs> and then the last one that I purchased was Tiffany D. 
and I got this basically my friend Amanda um, who is a subscriber to me told me that she got an order and that she adores this candle and I will tell you I don't really get a lot of melon I get more cotton candy in this one but it does smell really 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 good um so anyways and then with every order you get a free scent shot so my freebie scent shot was orange cream soda and this smells straight up like sun kissed it smells really good I really did like that and I'm sorry if I'm moving like along I just don't want it to be over 10 minutes Four of the scents I got because I knew I wanted them, and then the other two I got based off recommendations from the message board. So I'll start with the ones that I got first because um, I knew I would want them. And this one is a really pretty blue, and it's um, Karma is a Bleep. Or Karma is a Bleep. And it's basically supposed to be the smell of luscious Karma soap. And it's dead on. I mean, excuse Penelope barking in the background. It smells so good, you guys. I cannot, I cannot describe what this scent makes me feel. I love Karma to death. But anyway, that was the first one. The next one I got, based on people's recommendation uh, that I know I wanted, was Twilight. And this is a mix of Bella Swan and Edward Cullen. And you can definitely smell more of the Edward in this one. Um... I can't really explain to you, but it definitely does smell more like Edward. But I'm sure it probably is different each time she pours it, depending on the formula. The third one I got that I knew I wanted was this, and it's really pretty purple. I love this purple. It's um, rocks. I'm a rock star. And this is a um, lush rock star smell. And I'm telling you guys, I, it just, it's it just, it's just love. It smells exactly like the soap. I mean, exactly. And i uh, probably burn this one first, but I'm going to use those heart tarps up first. So then the fourth one that I knew I wanted, and it's basically because of my grandmother. My grandmother um, is from Germany. And um, where she is from, uh, this flower blooms wild, and this is her favorite flower, and I love the scent, and when I get married, this will be my wedding flower. <laughs> it's called Lily of the Valley. If it'll focus. There we go. Lily of the Valley. And I smell it, and I'm at my grandma's house. Like, it's insane. I mean, literally. So yeah, that's Lily of the Valley. Then the last two I got, I got based on recommendations from the message board. Like, and this is one that a lot of people said they liked. And this is Sexy in Stilettos. And it is based on, um, or inspired by a YouTube guru. And I cannot think of her name for the life of me right now. But I can't really explain to you what it smells like. But it does smell really, really good. And then the last one that I got, based on people's recommendation, was Tokyo Spring. And there's the label, and it's blue. If it'll focus, there we go. This smells like a tropical flower. I mean, I, I don't, I'm, I'm getting like all over the place. But it smells insanely good. This is... So I am already plotting another scent shot order, and since I know people on the message board watch these, and I know Victoria watches these, um, I want to find out what you guys think of the scent shots that I already have in mind to try. Blueberry cheesecake, because everyone seems to love blueberry cheesecake. Baked apple strudel, chocolate chip cookie, cinnamon raisin bread, cotton candy, Goldilocks, which I'm not really sure I'm going to try now, because everyone I've, I wanted to try it because people said it smelled like porridge soap, but then I've had a lot of people say it doesn't. Um, Marshmallow Campfire, a lot of people love that one. Indonesian Delight and Treasure Island. So those are the ones I'm thinking or contemplating trying. But anyway. <laughs> so um, if you guys are not subscribed to her channel, there will be a link in the sidebar. Um, and I hope you guys have a good day. And once again, thank you, Victoria and Matt and Chelsea and Amber, everyone there at Candles by Victoria. 
I love everything I got, and I hope you guys are having a good day. So 